Hello, today I am introducing our system, Gesture Knitter, which is a hand gesture design tool geared towards mixed reality applications. We will first introduce the problem and the specifications that drove our system design. Then we will detail the implementation of our approach and conclude with an overview of the evaluation. The emergence of head-mounted mixed reality requires the need for expressive gesture-based interaction. Expressive interactions are especially prevalent in a wide variety of applications, such as in education, 3D drawing and art, and gaming. However, there has been a lack of focus on protocols explicitly aimed at the designing hand gestures. Current approaches involve deep learning techniques for directly developing recognizers, which is data intensive. In contrast, we aim to design a system enabling the design of expressive hand gestures, encoding them into recognizers, while being low data intensive to enable rapid prototyping. We are motivated by a similar system, gesture script, which focuses on interactively designing 2D unistroke gestures with rendering scripts. We take a similar approach for hand gesture design. To meet our specifications, we take a software engineering approach to promote reuse. Specifically, we created a visual declarative script, allowing designers to create complex expressive gestures by concatenating simpler gestures. Next, we implemented a back-end process that converts the script into recognizers by using hidden Markov models. We also have a lightweight method of generating synthetic samples to aid in training the recognizers from a Bayesian preference gallery approach. For our script, we first divided hand gestures into two separate components, the gross component, which is the motion of the center of mass of the hand, and the fine component, which consists of the movement of the fingers. For example, gross gestures include forward and right, and fine gestures include thumbs up and pointing. We term these gestures as primitive gestures. Our visual declarative script concatenates these primitive gestures node by node to create a complex gesture. We, ena we enable designers to place the node sequentially as well as loop a particular node. For example, this script shows the movement of two hands with circles and fists, then forward and palm forward. We then take the visual declarative script and encode the complex gesture recognizer. Our method uses hidden Markov models, which enable the concatenation of recognizers of individual primitive gestures to form the complex gesture recognizer. This approach allows the reuse of component recognizers and forming ex expressive complex gestures. Our approach so far relies on the assumption that we have recognizers available for the gross and fine primitives to build the complex gesture recognizers. Although the user can provide hand demonstrations, this approach can be laborious and data intensive. To alleviate this, we implemented a synthetic data generator using a preference gallery, which can aid in the training process. The user can select which of the two options generated to put into the training data set, which adds sufficient perturbation. We also included additional tools to aid the designer in the design process. Our decoding mechanism allows the input of a complex gesture demonstration and automatically generates the visual declarative script. In addition, we provide a discernibility tool to notify designers if two gestures declared are difficult to, desert, to discern from each other. We evaluated gesture knitter's potential with an evaluation of the recognition rates using data we collected from participants using the HoloLens 2. Here evaluated are the train on all cross-validation between participants and synthetic data accuracy rates. These all show high feasibility and accuracy. The developer study also showed GestureNator was easy to use and intuitive. GestureNator therefore allows designers to expressively design novel and expressive hand gestures while having low data overhead. Our approach is practical and shows promise in deploying the recognizers generated to real world applications.